what's the process been like with, I guess, with the bigs kind of blending and, and, and finding each other? You all did a real good job of, uh, of finding each other tonight. He, you know, I think there were a couple of even uh, NOLA passes bet between you guys. What, uh, how's that been developed? Um, I think we kind of just built the concept of uh, just uh, creating an advantage and then playing off that advantage, um, finding an open guy. You know, if you got to attack, take that attack and then um, just create for others. Um, you know, you attack, somebody pulls over, kick, one more, um, just continue to find that open guy. Dre, this is the uh, the last competition that Coach Mack will be able to coach until the Michigan State game. Um, what do you think it'll be like for the next six games in game when when Coach Mack isn't there? Um, it's kind of hard to answer just because we haven't really experienced that yet. But um, I think it's the same expectations moving forward. You know, um, we kind of know what we got to do. Um, we have a baseline expectations that uh, you know the players we all know that we all have to focus on. Um, the attention to details there. So I think uh, we just continue to have the same expectation, the same energy, same pop, same focus uh, on both ends of the floor. In, in practice, have you all talked about how, how you may approach that in game or has it not been discussed yet? Um, I mean, we kind of do in certain areas, just, um, you know, being uh, scrimmaging against each other. Um, you know, you got two different coaches coaching. So uh, kind of have kind of had that experience, but uh, not to the full effect. But uh, like I said, just continue to focus on the details and trust the process of what we've been doing. You guys were 11 of 23 uh, from three tonight. Is that a result of extra work going into the season or guys being more relaxed, taking the shots, knowing that you guys uh, want to play a little faster pace? How do you explain the improved three-point shooting? I think it's a combination of things. You know, guys getting in the gym, working on their shot. Um, obviously, um, transferring in better shooters um, with Noah, uh, Matt, as you've seen tonight. Um, and then it's letting the offense work for us, you know, trusting our teammates, making that extra one more, uh, creating advantages, and uh, always finding an open man, uh, feet set, ready shot. So um, I think it's just a combination of things, all of the above. So like I said, just getting in the gym, finding the open one more, or uh, just having confidence and trusting to the next players. Dre, you're a guy where your coach, he wants you making plays and, and being kind of all over the floor. Do you like to have that that freedom to where you can kind of just go do your thing? Yeah, definitely. Um, I think I'm a versatile player that can be utilized in a lot of different ways. So um, just to have that freedom to be able to, you know, uh, get on the offensive glass, go, get on the defensive glass, push the ball, uh, create, whether it's for myself or for my teammates, and, you know, get after on defense end, I think, um, it really gives me a lot of confidence to uh, you know, go out there and do what I need to do to be able to help get the win. And, and also yourself, Sam, uh, Matt, you guys are, you all play the same position, but you all play it in a much different manner. What kind of options does that give for this team? Um, you know, I think it just uh, makes our actions a lot harder. It gives the defense a lot of different looks, you know. Um, obviously, Matt being a you know, really good spot up shooter. Um, you know, me and Sam being able to you know, attack off the dribble, create make plays as well as being able to, you know, knock down the open shot. So I think it just uh, makes our team a lot deeper, a lot harder to guard as well. Dre, who would you say are some of the team's best one-on-one -on -one players? If y'all were to play a one-on-one -on -one tournament, who do you think will win? I mean, I'm always have to say myself, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> nah, but uh, I mean, I think, uh, you know, guys are um, in their own way special as far as one-on-one, -on -one, you know. I think at any given time that uh, one of our players can break somebody off, down off the dribble and create whether it's for themselves or for a teammate, so I mean, it's, like I said, I mean, I'm gonna take myself, but like I said, I'm confident in any one of the guys being able to, you know, create whether it's off the dribble or off the shot fake, whatever the case may be, one on one. Dre, this new offense, this new system, I mean, it's a it's a process. Do you feel like you guys took a step forward in in, in what way tonight? Um, just continuing uh, our spacing. I think our spacing was excellent uh, tonight. Obviously, we can always grow and get better. Uh, I think pace was better. Obviously, like I said, we can grow and get better, but um, I think we took big strides as far as, you know, keeping our space, keeping our uh, pace of play, um, as well as finding the one more, extra one more, finding the open man, um, and getting guys going early.